69's ex Sarah Molina reacts to the baby and Danny Lay situation. I'm watching the same y'all watching. So he is violating. I mean, I would have never like felt so appalled and disgusted. And he just posted her live and did his um his little statements. We're really like oh he really taking this shit all the way is when he called her a side bitch on live and said her family knew about it and when he showed the baby like showing the baby was a big no-no why it's his baby she first of all she's the mother which overrides father anything she carried that baby i don't care what bro what are you talking about man what y'all say that baby she went through labor bringing that baby into the world so if she wants to feel like the world don't deserve to see her baby yet she has every right not to post the baby so what gives him the right to go ahead and do it good he he dipped out on her pregnancy she said like what gives you no what gives you the right you wasn't even here Someone said, I sell babies. Hit me up. That's sick. He did things to maliciously hurt her in such an evil fucking way. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. He can post his own child? No. It's different. If he would have did it, why post the baby now? Why? That's the thing. It's the motive. It's the intent. And that's why she didn't want to show her baby for fucking reasons like this on the internet her baby's not for show her baby's not for the internet it's not for her baby is not for any of us to see if she chooses that he decided of all moments his baby is a few months old he could have been posted her to do it now to maliciously hurt her and put the baby out there which is so fucked up it was out of spite that's some real evil shit it's the principal. Y'all saying that's his baby, bro. He was just kicking the baby out a few hours before that out of his house. It's his baby when y'all feel like y'all want to pick and choose and dictate and he wants to pick and choose and dictate when he's going to act right or be a father. He did it to hurt her. He posted that baby to hurt her. Y'all saying that's his baby, but he was just kicking Danny Lane and that baby out of his house for what? For what reason? She's laying down breastfeeding your baby too. Since y'all want to be like, that's his baby too. Why are you kicking her out the crib at that time? Tell her she need to go. She need to get the f out. He never claimed that baby girl until now. It's just the weird. And you know what's crazy? It's actually sad that I have women in here. Like defending him. She was bottle feeding, bottle feeding, breastfeeding. She was feeding their child on a bed at a certain time at night. And he's putting her on live and telling her she needs to go because he's or scared for his safety. Meanwhile, she has no more than a four month old in her hand feeding the baby. Like, yeah, I see how y'all want to twist and turn. He went, went on live. He did all of that shit to hurt and embarrass her for what whether it was for his other baby mom or to prove something that was just he did ultimate level of disrespect to hurt her no i just i feel strongly about certain shit. like certain people's characters and stuff like that there are people who see ugly but like well that's not my business oh no and then there's people who speak up and say stuff and possibly stop certain situations and address people. And, you know, it's just like, if you see something wrong now, why, why not speak up on it? You feel me? Like, y'all yeah, asked me my opinion, so I spoke up on it. For those who didn't, you can leave my life because you're a mother, you understand it. It's just like, women, you don't even have to have children you can have a mom that you seen go through this. Shit. 
You can have an aunt, a sister, whoever. As women, we're supposed to understand one in, one another in certain situations, and ha- like have women to fall back on and uplift us. And instead, you have ignorant women who are for a lifestyle, for clout, or whatever. Just like finding happiness in other people's sorrow and uh, in other people's pain and like that is is disgusting. You like. Yeah, there's some girls in com- in the comments laughing at this sh- knowing that this sh- is probably hurting this girl's heart. She's being ridiculed, she's being embarrassed, she's being so many like it's so much going on to her right now. She got called the side bitch. She got her baby shown. Like it's just like a lot. And there's women who find it funny. Women like ha ha good for you in the comments and will really be having me like so crazy like the main women that be like oh couldn't be me oh she's dumb this and that they don't have they probably oh they don't probably don't have no kids but they had a mama that went through the same their aunt probably went through the same they got a sister that got beat on a sister with like four different baby daddies like it just be too much yeah y'all don't even know if this girl going through postpartum depression there are women who themselves and their babies because their postpartum fucking psychosis and all this other bullshit there's not bull i'm just speaking how i speak but all this stuff that should be taken serious seriously isn't and it's not taken into account like oh this could be going on with her too this and that third do y'all ever sit back and think about that like she's a person she's like she just had a baby i'm actually worried about her safety i mean postpartum is no joke it's not you're right everything you're saying i mean i i, I will go today i'm like i saw it when i was out but i didn't really get to see the lives or nothing because i was out so i'm just like catching up with everything today i'm like oh f-. then i got on live and i got asked my opinion and i'm speaking as openly and honestly on how i feel and some people like it and some people don't false she just can't accept the fact that he has other women in his life if she couldn't accept that um that that does just doesn't make any sense she can't accept that but she went into the relationship knowing that he already had a daughter another baby mama and another baby mama and another daughter like she signed up i'm pretty sure she was accepting to the fact is she's not accepting to the fact that he's not gonna be loyal or a family man or misled her to the point where she is in love with him and has a baby. That's probably what she wasn't accepting, but she had to accept that. Because when you just got to accept it and move on. She thought she was better than the other baby mom. Stop. Like I said, I'm not here to defend anybody. I'm on. That's your opinion. I never got into like her really taunting the baby mamas or whatever. And this and that third. Like, I saw it here and there. But it was like regular back and forth. Like, they were both, oh, I'm his baby mama while I'm with him type. You feel me? Like, going back and forth with each other like that. It wasn't one or the other. It was both of them. You need a, in order to argue with somebody, you need another person to argue back with. Okay? So, they both did it to each other. Um... Like I said, y'all don't like her based off of that stuff from your own opinions. I don't like the baby based off of facts and what I saw. That's just it. And I feel bad for her based off of what was put out there. That is factual. Like, I'm, it's facts. He went, said what he said, did what he did, and it's all documented on the internet. So, I'm not saying that they all weren't petty. Like, they all were petty. All of them. That doesn't say, that doesn't mean that all women have babies with ain't men. That doesn't mean that, but I'm just saying. Majority of how today is and stuff like that, a lot of men who have children ain't. So, and that's the thing. Whatever I say is not to bash her at all. I don't, I'm, anything I'm actually talking and 
defending her whether she needs it, like showing my support. Cause he's disgusting. Ain't nobody mad at her on this side. I'm mad she didn't just walk out and leave, but he's the disgusting one. He's the one that people need to really cancel. Should have been canceled. Thanks for tuning in to Nine Mag TV.